It's an exciting time, it's an exciting project. We're going to test the feasibility of storing water underground. Crews are drilling to unlock the mystery of the Denver Basin. We're drilling what are called exploratory boreholes. It's all to evaluate deep rock formations for a concept called aquifer storage and recovery. That's where water is pumped into the ground and stored in aquifers during wet years and pumped back up, if needed, in dry years. There are years where our reservoirs uh, fill and spill, and those are the years that we would store the water underground. Little is known about the 2,000-foot deep basin under Denver. It's a collection of aquifers stacked like bowls underground. The tests will reveal the basin's water storing capacity. They're rock formations, but there's a porous space between the grains. Even though those spaces are very small, when you start adding it up with hundreds of feet and you go out miles and miles, that actually becomes a fair amount of volume that you can put water in. The large drilling rigs are testing four sites in Denver and may raise concerns about fracking, but that's not what this is. We're not fracking. Uh, this isn't even close to what fracking is. We're just drilling holes in the ground and then we're going to fill those holes back up after we get the data that we need. This also isn't about tapping into the aquifer as a new water source. It's a good solid deposit. You can Instead, Denver Water is examining underground storage as part of its long-term strategy to prepare for future challenges that include growing population and climate change. We're always looking ahead. It's something that Denver Water has always done. So we're just continuing the tradition of, of looking long-term to make sure our customers have enough water. It's a great alternative to sort of the conventional surface water storage where we build a dam and inundate an area and create a surface water reservoir. The findings will help determine if it's worth building a pilot well to further explore the feasibility of storing water underground. We can't sit still in planning for future water supplies. There's always uncertainties that we need to deal with. We have to leave no stone unturned. If test results are promising, the pilot well could be operational by 2019.